Okay, so, so this is the heart of the SED operations. Uh, essentially what we do is, we got the whiteboards where we uh, got all our artisans, we got all the contact details, what areas they cover, and you'll see from Monday to, to Sunday, we've got a color scheme system where we allocate to them um, what job numbers they got. We then have a color code to say, uh, you know, red, case receipt, yellow, artisan dispatched, blue, artisan at client, green, job complete, black, paperwork is done, because black is very, very important to us, because uh, anyone that knows the insurance industry without paperwork, you don't get paid. So, um, also part of our formal training process is that we train all our artisans on how to handle their paperwork, okay? It's, it's very important and uh, there's also an insurance certificate that goes with that where the client signs off and, and tell us about the service that he experienced. So for us, we monitor that on a regular basis to, to, to make sure that if there's any customer complaints, we try and handle it before it actually gets to a serious stage. So, and every customer complaint for us is, is a serious matter. So we try and have a 24 hour turnaround to resolve that customer complaint. Um, and, and by all means, um, you know, get, get our guys to, to sort out the problem. Obviously, there's some difficult clients that sometimes try and uh, you know pull the wool over our eyes and try and you know try and get us there for a freebie. But we try as far as possible to accommodate the client. So you'll see this is uh, the Gauteng area. Um, we got Cape Town the set up. Okay, uh, we've got on that side we've got Port Elizabeth and and, and Durban. We've also had um, uh, you know requests from our incident managers that they're looking at Nisna and certain George and certain areas where they're experiencing problems with plumbers. We're looking at expanding in those areas to, to just assist those, uh, the, you know, the, the, the incident managers with plumbers in those areas. So, so we are looking to expand so that we're able to, to cover those difficult areas. Thanks guys. Okay guys, so essentially this is our boardroom. Uh, look, today it's, it's, a, it's a more of a, a takeover, a restaurant, but we, we, we use this facility to do all our training. Um, so you'll see that uh, whenever we, we sign up a, a new plumber or electrician or artisan, the first thing we do is we orientate them of the way SED does business. Um, and the way we do business <coughs> is how we want to uh, have a consistent um, profile to each client. What we tell, what we tell all our, our all our artisans is that we want a brand as big as Nando's. So when you go into a Nando's store, you have the same taste and you have the same customer experience. So that is what we drill into our artisans um, for them, for us to make sure that every customer experiences uh, the similar quality of service. Um, and and if if he deals with an SED partner, he knows what he's dealing with, guys. Uh, we got our uh, uh, centre at the back there, another three call centre staff, we, 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 we'll be focusing just on foggy uh, jobs. Um, foggy jobs obviously is a more intricate uh, type of job, it's where uh, the insurance company pays for it, but we need to assess whether the geezer is under warranty or not, we need to assess whether um, you know the pipe is corroded or not, if it's corroded, they, it, it, in certain instances it's not covered. Uh, by the insurance company so for us it's critical that our guys uh, you know have a separate facility for foggy jobs because it's a more intricate and and and, and complicated uh, uh, you know uh, procedure to assess so guys thank you very much for joining me um, for the tour you guys are welcome to to sit with us and have some snacks and uh, please enjoy yourself thank you